Hi there, it's Minecraft Grand, the geeky Minecrafter, just at home on the weekend, and it's raining outside. So I thought what we'd do, since I love the great outdoors and I can't actually be out there, I thought we'd play a little Minecraft. Uh, today I think we're going to do the Cherry Vanilla server. So if you're ready, come on, let's get started. Ah. See, I love the out of doors. i got to have pictures uh, everywhere. Here we go. Make this bigger. Multiplayer. Let's go to Cherry. Oh, Cherry's pretty busy. There's ten people online. Let's see. Where am I? Forty-five sales. What? Wow. Wow. Good <laughs> grief. That's craziness right there. Um, what do I need to restock? Looks like, um, looks like probably books, if I'm guessing. Okay, okay. My keys are all locked up. Oh, there it goes. Okay, don't know what's going on there. Okay, what do we need? We need, um, let's see. Redstone. Oh, I'm out of redstone. Uh, you know what? That can't be right. Or I've carried it all upstairs. Let, let's go upstairs and look. So, it's been a little while since I've been up here. We've had a couple of other projects. Uh, the mob farm is nearly finished. If you watched the last video, you know that um, I have all three floors dried in, wired up. I have, uh, oh, look at target practice. I have the torch tower in down to the pad where it's got to be. I do not have the chicken farm set up down there. And I was going to use a chicken uh, because they lay an egg, what, about every five minutes, right? Uh, let's go ahead and take a few of these. Oh, no, I have all the water done. Never mind. Oh, hello. Hey, hey, hey. Uh oh. Um, for those of you who don't know, I am my mother's caregiver. I have IP cameras trained on her so I can see when she needs help. I can see that she needs help. Um, so I need to take a little five minute respite. I will be right back. Okay. Sorry about that. Thank you. Uh, did I miss anything? <laughs> nope. Okay, so this is the where the sorter room is going to be, which, which basically means my chicken farm or my chicken timer is going to be right over here somewhere. I'm going to wire it in, or perhaps over on this side, uh, wire it in so that it flows into this and ignites the um, torch tower every five minutes, basically. And then once it ignites, let's see, where's my... Tell me I have dark oak. Good grief. This cannot be all. I bet it's upstairs. So every five minutes, it will ignite and drop. Here, let's... Uh, this is the splat pad. This is where I need to work. It'll drop them out of the... Uh, flow them out of the uh, upstairs area and drop them onto this splat pad. When the water flows... Oops, here, let's do two. Oh, I suppose I need to count. Hold on. Did, did we already decide? I may already be to width. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. I was already to width. Okay, so seven is the number of holes that will be open. The hoppers will basically just need to be all along here. I need a bunch of iron. I need a bunch of chest. It's crazy how much I need. So let's go up here and show you the rest, and then uh, we'll get busy. I don't know about you, but this has been a big project. What, we're on video five already? Is that right? So this is the bottom floor. All of the uh, dispensers are in. Oh. 
Oh, you know what? I'm not going to put all the water in until I've got the wiring done. Uh, been down this road before. So I think, yeah, let's just put these in here. Uh, ba -dee -ba -dee -ba -dee -ba -dee. Come on. I'll take this, put that up there. There's the iron and the chest that I'm going to need for this. I think we just, I think I did the math. I think it's like 320 um, chest or hoppers that I'm going to need for this flat pad. I have considered an alternative design um, that I saw uh, in a recent Mumbo Jumbo video. He created a splat pad that is covered in um, railroad tracks. And there's redstone blocks and powered rails. And a minecart just runs up and down, up and down the length of the railroad, or the length of the splat pad. Right in the center, there's a row of hoppers that flow across there and then drop down to the sorting room. So, and then the minecarts that go across are what? Either they're hopper, hopper mine carts, right? So the drops fall, the mine carts flow across, it sucks it up, puts them in there. Well, when they flow across the hoppers, they're being drained every time they flow across. So then that takes it and puts it up on the, um, up on the uh, sorter room. So I'm thinking that's a lot fewer hoppers. It's maybe, you know, 80 or 90 hoppers to flow it across and then drop it down and move it to where you want it to be. I'm thinking that that may be a better choice. Now, I've never done one, uh, so I probably need to experiment. Um, I don't think I have any rails here. So who's up for an experiment? Okay, so what do you think about trying the minecart bit instead of... I mean, what's the worst that can happen, right? I've got, I've got the iron. I can try the rails. Now, sadly, you can't uncraft something. So if I craft the rails, I'm stuck with rails. Uh, I'll just have to go mining for some more, um, some more iron. But in his design, all of this, all the way down, up and down, was gold. And then there were blocks, like here, so they, you know, they flowed into the blocks, they stopped. There was a powered rail here, they went headed back the other direction. And right along in the center, or maybe it's, you know, maybe it's, in my case, it'll be a little less, right? I maybe do it right, right around, around in here somewhere. Flow it down to the sorter room down below. This was my intended area that I dropped down. Tell me I have birch. No, I'll put glass right there for now. So this was the intended area that Hopper was going to drop down, but you know I can just as easily design around moving it four blocks. So, you know what? I think I'm going to try it. Anybody see any reason not to try it? Anybody know anything about the mechanics? You know what? Maybe I should test first. Maybe just a little test. So, okay. Let's go to the base. We'll get, um... We'll get some powered rails, we'll get some redstone, we'll get some regular rails, a minecart, a couple of hoppers, and we'll just test if it's gonna if it's gonna work. Um ba -dee -ba -dee -ba -dee. Can I, do I have any place to test it? Maybe maybe right down here. A wide open spot, that's what I'm thinking. Okay, so I need um I need this redstone block. So we'll say, oops, we'll say this is our power, right? Where is our gold? Okay, three, four. One more, one more. Okay, one more. Just need to turn that one. And uh, let's throw a block right here, because this will be the turnaround, right? Really? Because I can't hold on to that stuff. This will be where the hopper goes, right? So we'll have a hopper going this away, and then a rail on top of that, right? Okay, so if we put a chest right here. 
So here's the premise, right? Mine oh, I forgot the minecart. Good grief. Uh, I think I have enough right here. Oh, no, this is what I meant. Sorry. So minecart. And a hopper in the minecart, right? Is this right? God, I hope this is right. Okay, so what I want to do is I want to drop a bunch of stuff all across here, right? being picked up, right? And it's dropping it off as it goes over this, right? Oh, and you have to unlock this, right? And... Tell me my hoppers are working, right? This is unlocked. Doesn't this flow into this? Okay, let's try this go a little bit more. Why isn't it flowing in there? What am I doing wrong? Is this why? Do I have uh, do I have power that gets to this, which is locking this hopper? No, it can't be true because it's flowing into this one. Okay, let's try this. Okay, so what do I need? Normal rail here, right? Bet. Let's do this. Let's go. One there. One there. And I need a normal rail. Oh, God. I keep thinking that's my um, crafting table. So, is this? Yes, it is. Okay. That means I'm going to need a charge on this one. For right now, let's just do that, right? That one's fired. That one's fired. All the way down. Okay. Where's my little hoozy? What's it? Oh, it came apart. Really, I didn't know they could do that. Oh, good grief. Minecart with hopper. Okay, let's go. Uh oh. I see. Okay, let's move it, move it, move it. Hmm. So down here away from this is the premise. Now let's go see if it's working. Nothing in there. Oh, good grief. 
Here they come. So wait. Okay, so here's what we learned. We cannot have a powered rail on top of the hopper. Good to know. Uh, we do need power on either side. And I'm gonna need obviously more than this because uh, because we're gonna be going up and down. Uh, now here's what I want to know. Oh, see, go, go, go. Come on, go. Go, come on. Do they all have to be gold? That's my question. Oh yeah, or powered at least. Um, so if I did a line of... <laughs> right? Again, I'm just answering the question, do they all have to be powered? I don't think they do. So I'm thinking, design-wise, let's see, how long will it flow on one power? Is it four blocks or eight blocks? Let's find out. Okay, so. This is my, this is my design lab. <laughs> We're just experimenting. Oops, did not mean to do that. That's fine. Okay, so I don't want this one, right? This one will start it back the other direction. I want to move this down to here, for example. So... If I do this, um, I should get a good signal, right? Let's see, do that, and that. This will give us, I want this one gone, because when gold, when powered rails are not connected to a power source, they immediately stop, right? It's like a break. So we want this one, this one, and I'll put redstone right here. Will that be enough, do you think? Let's find out. Okay, so that's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. So this is a good question because uh, it's it's going to give us, it'll tell us how, how long it'll go, right? Can I do this in here? I can, sweet. Okay, that's not bad. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Eight between. So at a minimum, every eight have a row of this redstone that goes across and the rest are normal rails. And the reason I do this is because I've got a lot more iron than I have gold. So I think this will work. And we'll just run the hoppers through here. I probably need maybe two rows of hoppers, you know, because it's it's only offloading one every time it flows by. I don't want it to get backed up. Oh, did I just stop that? Yeah, that's not good. Really? Come on. Okay, so at 8, uh, it's pretty sensitive. And as I collect more gold, I can probably do this. Do, do more of this. So, let's do this. Let's make... Hmm. You know what? I think I've already used most of my gold. I may have to go into town and see if I can trade for that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, I have one left. Let's go see what I have downstairs. I don't, I don't think I have much. I've started widening my... Uh, oh, you know what? I almost forgot. I hope my cows are not dead. Oh, they're still there. And I have a live one here. Yay! So, <laughs> last episode, off-camera... I managed to get 
two cows into this hole. Now, I had dug all this out and was walking them across with leaves. It was crazy. I'm just saying. But I now have cows in here. I don't have any lava over on the left yet because I'm still trying to get, you know, more than two or three cows. Okay. So there's two cows in there right now. I don't want anything in there, so I'll just I'll let them make a baby and we'll come back later. Okay, so let's go down here and see how much gold I have. I don't think I have enough. I may need to ask uh, in town if anybody has any. What I have is money, but no gold. So maybe somebody will sell me some. Uh, I got ten I can smell. That's just not enough. Yeah, I've converted it, huh? <laughs> okay. Powered rails. <laughs> Let's throw this in the cooker and we'll head to town and see if we can't buy some. Put some of this food away. I love that taken items out of the furnace will help mend my um, my tools. I think that's just amazing. Okay, so... Anyone is selling? Alright, let's jump into spawn and see what we have going there. Um, I know that uh, stack and a half, really? Very made supplies. I'm guessing there's not going to be gold in here. Iron barding, barding. So, what does he want? Okay. Do you need? We can trade. Minds of Fortune. See, this is why I came over here. I thought he might. Eight for twelve? Hmm. <laughs> oh. Let's see. Does he have any? Out of stock. Of course! Out of stock. Oh, come on. Anybody? Anybody? Slime pins. Stain clay. See, I like that they're doing some of the rare items, but... Um... Oh, here we go. Let's see. What did he say to me? Donate to the cause. Sweet. Really appreciate that. Sweet. You guys are awesome. Awesome. Last of the mob farm. 
good grief. Oh, they just they just left. Okay, so again to both of you. You're making this possible. I don't know how many gold rails I'm going to get out of this, but uh, surely it's better than what I had. Now, one experiment we didn't do was um, how far away from the minecart, the hoppered minecart, can you be, and it still suck up the stuff that's being dropped. Now, remember, I'm going to have rails that go all the way across. That's good guys. Good guys. Okay, so let's do this one and this one. And what was it? Here and here? Is that right? Yeah. Okay, so that's uh, that's two almost two and a half stacks. Let's see what do we have enough to do. Oh let's do that. That's three stacks and change and We'll make some um we'll make some regular rails when we get upstairs. 